Hi, I'm Eric Jackson. I hold 96 Yahoo shares, and a year ago I started a grassroots web-based campaign for other Yahoo shareholders to stand up and ask Yahoo's board and management to fight for some needed changes to turn this company around and make it successful. We were successful. We built a coalition of 100 shareholders holding 2.1 million Yahoo shares, and we forced some change at the last annual meeting in terms of a large against vote uh, against a number of the directors that caused a changeover in leadership last June, and we've been sitting and watching and hoping that this company would put it together uh, in the eight months since then. It hasn't. Uh, but a week ago, all Yahoo shareholders got a reprieve when Microsoft made a 61% um, premium offer uh, to buy the company based on the Thursday previous close of uh, $19 uh, and made a $31 bid. Uh, I found out yesterday that uh, Yahoo's board has deliberated and is planning on tomorrow rejecting this offer saying that it massively undervalues the company and uh, intimating that they wouldn't accept anything less than $40 a share. Uh, this has outraged me and some of the other Yahoo shareholders that I've spoken with since then. And we are rejecting Yahoo's rejection of this offer. And we've decided to form another group and we're calling on other Yahoo shareholders who are similarly dissatisfied with this board of directors uh, and who don't feel that this board of directors truly represents them and their interests. And we're asking you to break away and pledge to our group, uh, the Plan B group for Yahoo. Really, I guess we're on to Plan C now. And basically saying that we, as a, as a shareholder group, uh, as a holder of at least 2.1 million shares today, we are ready to tender those shares to whoever steps forward and makes the best offer. There's an offer on the table now of $29 and change at the current valuation of Microsoft. Uh, we would like to see other bidders step forward. We would like to see Microsoft step forward with a more aggressive bid. But we, our shareholder group, is willing to tender our shares. We also believe that Yahoo's board doesn't have the moral authority to speak for us. And if you feel the same, we're asking you to, to pledge your shares similarly to our group. Uh, go to the blog breakoutperformance.blogspot.com. Uh, you'll see a button on the top right where you can uh, very easily click on that, pledge, you know, say who you are, say how many shares you own. No share count is too small. Uh, we're calling on all individual shareholders, all institutional shareholders to stand up and say, Yahoo's board, you don't speak for us. Uh, several of the directors, including the current chairman, got it at 36% of the vote cast against them last year. We think we can represent our own interests uh, better ourselves, and we were ha are happy to break away from the pack. Uh, if you feel the same, we'd love you to join us. We think there's a better way. We don't just have to sit back as shareholders and wait for whatever outcome plays out. We are not comfortable with this company saying that they are willing to play chicken with our shares and go it alone and go back to a 17 or less stock price. Uh, we think we can get a better outcome ourselves, and I hope you join us. Thanks.